guys, what's up, what's going on, and welcome back to the channel. Today's Tuesday, and y'all know what that means. It's time for some tools. Yeah, it has been a week since I've been able to do a video. Um, tool videos are kind of easy to do because they're in the heat of my garage. So um, I'm able to get out here and do these. It's kind of been, Sunday was a great day. It was 50 some degrees out, but we had other plans, had things to do and just wasn't able to get out and do anything. So I wanted to come back tonight and bring you guys a tool video at least and uh, show you some things that I picked up. We do have some more Icon stuff and we have two new products from Hot Shot Secrets. Um, as you guys know, I am a huge, huge advocate of Hot Shot Secrets. First link in the description, it's always there, is uh, Hot Shot's website. And also, you guys, if you wanna use my coupon code on any product that they have on their website, it's 10% off your entire purchase. CM73 is that coupon code. And you know what, if it's your first time joining us, why don't you hit that subscribe button in your lower right hand corner and become part of the family. And also hit that bell notification so you are up to date anytime that I upload a video. <clears throat> Tonight I wanted to bring you, like I said, some icon tools. I have uh, two sets of sockets here, um, some impact sockets, I got some SAE sockets and I have some metric, metric sockets. Uh, these are the ones I was talking about that I wanted to pick up. These are the shallow well impacts. Um, I really didn't have a use for them um, per se, but the more and more I got to thinking about them, sometimes the deep wells that I have um, are too long to get into certain places. And also, you know, if I'm just taking the head of a bolt out, why use a deep well um, when the shallow well will be just fine um, on my D wall cordless impact that I have. So I went ahead and I picked up both of these right now until the 29th of February. Icon does have a coupon running for 20% off of um, your entire purchase of Icon tools. And I just received my new Harbor Freight catalog or magazine today in the mail and I noticed there is another 20% off coupon in there, but I couldn't quite see the date so I'll have to check that and I'll probably put it right here someplace so you guys can see the date on that 20% off coupon. Now that coupon is good for their tool storage and it is also good for tools is what I read on that coupon. So um, I just wanted to show you guys these two shallow well sets that I picked up. I got the, the 13 piece or somewhere the 14 piece SAE and I also have the 13 piece metric. Now uh, before we get into these, I was kind of disappointed again um, this is a skip set on, I, I, I did, the first one I noticed it on was the metric. So it's kind of disappointing to me that, you know, they started out as a non-skip set brand, but the more stuff they come out with, they, they're starting to skip some stuff. Uh, first thing I noticed that's missing out of here was the 20, I believe so, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, the, the 20 is missing and so is the 23 the 24 and the 25 they go from 19 to 21 to 22 to 26 and 27 so you know it's kind of getting a little bit disappointing with the, with the icon stuff as far as them missing uh you know before i thought it was pretty cool they were a non-skip set as far as the wrenches and stuff that i already have i mean these are a chrome molly construction just like all the other stuff that i've purchased um before we get into too much, I wanted to show you, I've got my, my Craftsman deep well over here, and then over on this side, I have my, uh, my metric icon stuff. And I ran into a little issue when I was installing my BD diesel um, fuel heater on my air dog. So I kind of wanted to show you, I wanted to show you what the issue I had was. So uh, before we go in too much further, let's look at some of the, uh, let's look at the Hot Shot Secrets products, the new stuff that they have to offer, and then we'll get into the sockets. All right, first up, we're gonna talk about the Spray and Stay Grease. Um, it's a no drip formula, and it does protect against rust and corrosion. I'm gonna say, if you hear the ball inside there, this is probably like your white lithium grease. Um, I have not used it yet. I have just received both of these new products from Hot Shots. I saw that they released them on Facebook Live last week. So on Friday or on Thursday later on the afternoon, I went ahead and placed an order and got two bottles. Now the spray and stay is uh, $14 and this is, and the Never Rust is $13. And then if you use your 10% off, 
Yeah, you can do the math. You know, if you want to order both of them, if you want to order one of them. So I'm going to say like the spray and stay is going to be like your white lithium grease. Um, whether you use it on hinges, doors, uh, you know, the hinges of the doors, um, or on your vehicle, your garage door opener, my garage door opener up there is a screw type, so I could use on that, you could use on chains. So I'm gonna be pretty, I'm gonna be using this, and then I'll give you guys a definitive answer whether um, I like it or not. I do not use a lot of uh, the white lithium grease, or we're gonna call it the spray and stay from Hot Shots. So I'm kind of curious on how this is gonna do. What I may try this on this year would be like my hedge trimmers uh, to keep those bars lubricated as they run back and forth like that. So we'll see how this goes. The Never Rust, this is going to be like your WD-40. Um, I've used a product in the past called Crown. Um, they have some uh, some rust pretend, or some penetrant, some rust penetrant. So um, we're going to see how well, and this claims it does 20 times more rust protection or it has 20 times more rust protection than wd-40 so um, this is, it says blocks rust and corrosion from forming stops squeaks excellent penetration and it's operating is from negative 65 to 300 degrees so kind of anxious to try some of this out it also does have the the shaker ball inside there like a spray bomb or like your white lithium grease most of your white lithium greases it does have the shaker ball on there too um, both directions say to shake before use. So, uh, and and both of them are an eight to ten inches away for for uh, application. So, like I said, I'm, I'm anxious to use the Never Rust, just because I use a lot of WD-40 um, or a lot of Penetrant, LE, Blaster, whatever you want to call it, um, different products like that. That's what I use. So both of these are gonna go in that little can caddy on the side of my toolbox, and when I need them, they're right there and ready for me to use them. So like I said, guys, these are some new products available from Hot Shot Secrets. Uh, if you go to the first link in the description, like always, and use coupon code CM73, it'll get you guys a 10% discount on your entire purchase. Next up, we're gonna have some Icon Shallow Well Impact Sockets. I wasn't certain in the beginning if I wanted some shallow well sockets. But the more I got to thinking about it, just like I told you guys in the intro, I think they're going to be ideal for me for getting into tight places. Um, I most of the time, I always use deep wells. Well, sometimes the deep well is just a little bit too long on my impact. So I, I, I molded around, I thought about it, and the more I thought about it, I wanted to get a set of the Icon Shallow Well Impact Sockets. And like I said, these are a Chrome Molly. Um, on the SAE, we're going from 7 16 up to inch and a quarter. So, I mean, we don't have the 3 8 I've got the 3 8 here on my Craftsman Set Deep Well. So, one of the things that I noticed on my Craftsman impact sockets as you guys can see that doesn't start or you know it, it has like a little indentation right in there before it grabs a hold of the nut now the other week this one is more flat and more forgiving which i like the other week i was doing the installation of the air dog i'm sorry of the uh, the, the bd fuel heater on my air dog and i ran into an issue of getting this piece out and putting this piece in. Uh, this isn't the one I needed, it's just the extra one that they send depending upon which style of air dog you have. As you can see, there's just a little bit of taper right there on the nut. And then as I would go up there and try and grab a hold of that, because this is flat on the surface, it would not, because of the recess before the hex actually starts on the Craftsman, I could not grab a hold of that to put that in. So I was kind of, Disappointed, I couldn't figure out why I couldn't take it out. And this is the, I only have deep well, I'm sorry, yeah, I only have deep well impact sockets. So that's another thing I'm gonna have to pick up too is some regular uh, impacts or some regular sockets that are deep well because those do kind of like these have the your hex clear out flush with the surface of the socket. So the, the icon is pretty good as far as, um, you know, your hex pattern starting closer to the edge um, that way it can grab a hold of that 
earlier or quicker than you know what this set did here uh, my craftsman set so that was one thing i did like that i saw and i noticed on the icon is your hex being more flush to surface instead of recessed like this craftsman depot set even on the metric icon uh it is more flush with the surface as far as your hex uh, than even what the the craftsman is too. So it pretty much coincides with the SAE and the metric Doing you know thin nuts like that um, It makes it kind of difficult to get these out or even nearly impossible to get these out when that's recessed Like it was just one of the things I noticed on my craftsman that I have never really ran into until that point in time this is kind of the plan as of right now. It does make it kind of large, rather large and bulky. So we'll just have to see if I want to keep it this way or if I want to order uh, another set of rails, uh, two more sets of rails, uh, one for metric and one for standard. Within the American set or the SAE set, like I said, you, uh, you do have a 7 16 a half inch, a 9 16 a 5 8 an 11 16 three quarter, a 13 16 a 7 8 a 15 16 a one inch, a one and one sixteenth, a one and one eighth, and a one and a quarter. So as far as the SAE, not bad. It is missing some different sockets, um, like I said, with the three eighths. Um, other than that, I don't think it's missing too much more. Um, I do, I mean, it's bigger. The biggest I go up to on my deep well is one and a sixteenth. So this does go uh, one size bigger with one and a quarter. Um, I'm sorry, two size bigger with one and an eighth and one and a quarter. So that, that does make it pretty nice. Although I do not have them in a deep well, which is fine. This is a craftsman set and this is the icon set here. So um, all in all, the construction looks pretty good. One thing I did notice as far as the icon stuff, and I've noticed it with the deep well that I have now also, their sockets have a matte finish, which is cool. I like them. But when they come, they are very oily and greasy. Um, the finish on the Craftsman is different. Um, so I, it's going to be kind of, we're going to kind of have to see how these weather. Um, I do not heat my garage at all the time. So after these wear and that film wears off of them, will the icon set start to rust? That's, that's one thing that I am very curious about what's going to happen with the icon sets. Um, after they do try or after they do get some age on them are they gonna rust because they don't have that film protection on them anymore like I said they're they're really oily you can see where I've wiped these off just a little bit and the lint has stuck to the sockets themselves just like the SAE set um, the metric set is 14 piece the SAE set is 13 piece I believe in the beginning I had that backwards but we're starting off with a 10 millimeter and going up to 27. So we have a 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. We're going to skip 20, go to 21, 22. We're going to skip 23, 24, and 25 and go to 26 and 27. So like I said, I mean, I know I'm going to sound like a broken record because I keep saying, you know, that they're skipping some, the, some sizes, whether they think there are some non-crucial sizes or not, I have used. Um, a 23, a 24, and a 25 before on certain said items. And I have used a 20, a 20 also. So like I said, it's kind of disappointing that uh, they're, they're starting to skip some stuff. Uh, I don't know if they just did that in the beginning with the wrenches to kind of get you hooked. But um, yeah, I mean, all in all, again, they're a chrome mile design. Got the nice, it is not a recess on your hex or on your size. This is a 14, so it's not recessed at all. Um, they got the nice legible uh, 14 stamped or finished right there. And then it says icon in the traditional icon font right there. Uh, the font style, like I have said in the past, it does mimic the Snap-on brand. So um, I don't know. I, 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 for the money, like I said, they're 20% off these. I got both sets. Um, both sets of shallow well for $102 with the 20% discount. So not bad money, really. I mean, they're a lifetime warranty. Um, you can take one in and they will break open another package and give you the size that you have broken. Or I probably, if you wanted to take them all in, um, they would probably give you a whole new set if you wanted to just take the whole set in, whether you have the box or not. I took back some uh, torques um, 
I did not have the box for the Torx. One of you guys had told me that they did offer a 24 piece set of the Torx versus the seven piece set or whatever it was and then did have some smaller sizes in there. So I took back the ones that I had, they exchanged them, no questions. I took them back in a Ziploc bag. So I thought that was pretty cool. All right, that's pretty much all I have. I just wanted to show you guys the new, some new icon stuff that I did pick up and also show you some new stuff from Hot Shot Secrets that they have released. We got the Never Rust Penetrant or Lubricant, and then we have the Spray and Stay Grease. Um, probably gonna use the Penetrant, I'm gonna call it Penetrant. It's, it's Never Rust. I mean, I'm gonna call it Penetrant. We're gonna, or the, you know, it's a WD-40 equivalent. I'm gonna call it that. They, they go above and beyond, Hot Shots does, on all their testing and coming up with their names. I, you know, the, the Never Rust, they could have left the, the lubricant off of there, just called it Never Rust. Um, it does kind of, the, the name does kind of remind me of the, the, the Crown product, you know. Uh, I've used that on my trucks before. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have. Just wanted to show you guys some new products from Hot Shot Secrets and show you guys some Icon sockets that I did pick up the other day. Um, these are just released within the last few months uh, when I went and picked up the Deep Well from Icon. Uh, to show you those, they did have these out. Uh, the first sets of deep well, I'm sorry, the first sets of impact, impacts that they had out were just 3 8 um, I really don't have a need as of right now for any 3 8 impact sockets, so uh, we're just going to kind of hold off on getting any of those. The next thing I probably would like to pick up is just some regular deep wells. I do not have any of those in half inch. Uh, I do have a lot of deep well in 3 8 so. I guess with that being said, if you don't mind, hit that like button, give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you have not already done so, and we'll talk to you guys later on. Bye-bye.